My name is Helen Skinner and I am the Alzheimer Scotland Dementia Nurse Consultant in NHS Fife in Scotland and we have been using twiddle muffs for several years. A twiddle muff is a soft knitted muff often made from different colours and textures of wool with the addition of knitted or crocheted twiddly bits on the inside and the outside to provide simple stimulation for active hands. This offers tactile, visual and sensory distraction for a person with dementia experiencing stress or distress as a result of their illness. And at the same time, keeping hands snug and warm. We have been using twiddle muffs now for several years to support patients with dementia who are in hospital, but we also use them in care homes or people living at home with dementia. The twiddle muff does not replace nursing care and is used to complement and support a person centred plan of care. There is no guarantee that the twiddle muff will be successful in supporting the patient and it is important that the effectiveness of its use is assessed. Using twiddle muffs has been embraced by the nursing, medical and allied health professional teams in NHS Fife. Healthcare staff would much rather use a non-pharmacological approach to managing distress in patients with dementia than use medication. So making twiddle muffs available has given an extra support tool to the healthcare team, which once they have seen the benefits of using, they have no hesitation in using as a first choice of action, leaving medication as the last resort. As far as we know, there isn't any research to demonstrate the benefit of twiddle muffs, but their use with patients with dementia as a therapeutic intervention has been recognised as beneficial and their use is spreading across the UK. It is quite common to see patients with dementia with what we call agitated hands, where they might be distressed by a catheter tube, a nasogastric tube, or an intravenous drip and sometimes trying to pull these things out. Using a twiddle muff can reduce this by keeping their hands occupied and providing sensory stimulation, which can help avoid any accidental removal of catheters, tubes and drips, which will then be required to be replaced, all of which can be traumatic for the patient. The potential risks associated with twiddle muffs are that they could pose a threat to patients if they detach and swallow any of the twiddle libits or due to infection risks if a contaminated or soiled item is used. Within the hospital, the risk associated with using a twiddle muff has been assessed. We've written a risk assessment for their use and also a guideline for staff. To reduce the potential risks involved in using a twiddle muff, the staff caring for the patient will check the integrity of the item, looking for any loose twiddly bits before giving it to the patient. The twiddle muff will be then checked at least daily or whenever it is offered to the patient to ensure no attachments have become loose. At the same time, the staff will check for evidence of contamination and if there are any infection control or hygiene concerns, the item will be discarded and a replacement provided. Twiddle muffs are donated to the hospital by individuals and knitting groups. We are very lucky in Fife to have such wonderful supporters who take the time and use their wool to knit these wonderful items. It is amazing how something so simple can have such a big impact for people with dementia. If you would like to ask me anything about using twiddle muffs, please contact me on the email address on the screen or via the Twitter handle. Thank you.